How many times do you wake up in the middle of the night to go pee? If you wake up more than once, it might be too much. Having to urinate frequently can affect your ability to sleep properly, to work, exercise and perform daily activities. And if you're waking up in the middle of the night more than once, this could mean there's a health condition you still haven't realized you have. So in today's video, I'm gonna reveal why you might be peeing so much and how to treat this abnormal urinary frequency naturally and effectively. Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLandivar.com. In this channel, as a conventional doctor, I treat my patients through natural medicine before recurring to the use of pharmaceutical drugs. So if you don't know my channel, consider subscribing and press that bell down below to see notifications and be the first one to watch a new video. If you need a line of point quality supplements for your disease, visit DrLandivar.com and stay till the end of this video. I'm gonna share extra tips and video links related to this topic. Many people think that urinating frequently is something healthy, and this might not always be true. You see, the human body is healthiest when it reaches equilibrium. You have to rest, obviously, you have to rest between seven to nine hours, not less, not more. And the same thing with peeing. If you eat, you should be somewhere between three to five times per day. And the same thing happens and applies to urination and bowel movements, very important. If you're well balanced and there's equilibrium, then you will have health. Disease usually appears when the body is lacking or has too much of certain substances or an activity, so be careful. So in today's video, I'll reveal the many reasons why you might be peeing so much and what you can do to solve this health condition naturally and effectively. Number one, you might be suffering from inflammation. You'd be surprised how often inflammation tends to affect the frequency of peeing. You see, inflammation usually occurs when we eat foods that are not at all healthy to us, obviously causing inflammation, genetically modified grains, processed goods, and much more. Now, there are several ways in which you can reduce inflammation effectively, and this is very important, so pay attention. One is obviously reducing the consumption of inflammatory foods like drinks, sodas, packaged goods, etc. And the other is taking natural supplements that have the power to reduce inflammation within and solve your problem. I always recommend my patients to take a good concentrated formula of curcumin and something that can improve their thyroid function at the same time. They go by the hand. Both of these have proven to be, time and time again, very helpful against inflammation and frequent urinary visits to the bathroom at night. So you might want to try it. If you need quality formulas you can use to improve health and inflammation, lowering the body overall, look for Appleizer and Curcu Health from Finland at DrLandivar.com. Number two, you might have diabetes. I have an entire video on early diabetes symptoms if you want to check it out right after this episode. I really recommend it, but I must say that this is very, very important, a very important subject. And frequent urination is a very important symptom of diabetes. Both diabetes type 1 and type 2 present frequent urination. You see, with diabetes, the body tries to get rid of all that sugar that can't be metabolized, and it's obviously still circulating in our system. This is the main reason why the body produces large amounts of urine and ends up affecting our normal daily functioning of the organism. Besides frequent urination, other common symptoms that you might see include, for example, thirst all the time, weight changes, numbness and tingling in hands and feet, very frequent, frequent urinations, and a dry skin. If you need something natural that can improve glucose metabolism in diabetes and help improve your metabolic process, look for Neuromatrix and Metaglucose from Finland at DrLandivar.com. These formulas contain more than 20 100% natural ingredients for this purpose and many, many more. Number three, you could have a urinary tract infection. Frequent urination is also a very common symptom of urinary tract infections. Very common. This happens when bacteria that enters the urinary tract causes UTI symptoms. Basic. Now, if you're experiencing frequent urination, make sure to see if this symptom is not coming along with pain during urination or a burning sensation that you might have in your bladder. If it does, then you might have a urinary tract infection, a UTI. UTIs can really damage your kidneys if you do not get proper treatment. So be careful. If you need something natural that can prevent UTIs and improve any condition aligned with UTIs and your health, 
of the kidneys and well functioning, look for urescence and deberry from Finland at drlandivar.com. Number four, you might be eating diuretic foods. Millions of people don't realize that they are eating diuretic foods. This is the reason why they're constantly going to the bathroom. For example, mint or mint tea is a diuretic food. Pineapple, also very helpful. Leafy green vegetables, diuretics. People who go vegetarian on a diet often experience frequent urination due to high potassium and magnesium, and obviously very common also as a diuretic food. You have to pay close attention because your foods may be causing the frequent urination you are suffering, and sometimes you do not know this. Number five, your thyroid might need some help functioning. The thyroid gland is crucial also for overall health. And if you get the picture, if your thyroid is not working, urinary system goes out of whack. The thyroid plays a very important role in every single cell of your body, including your kidneys. And when your thyroid, for some reason, isn't reacting the way it should be, problems start to appear all over the body. It's very frequent to see how poor thyroid function can accelerate urine production. Not many people know this, and quite a good number of my patients have seen that peeing is a condition that actually goes tight to thyroid problems. What I suggest you do, obviously, is fix your thyroid. Try to take a supplement that can help you out with, with this specifically. If you need a good supplement formula for your thyroid to react, and actually will also react your entire body, look for Metathyroid or Appleizer from Finland at DrLandivar.com. Number six, you might be drinking too much or taking diuretic medications. Now, when I say drinking too much, I'm not only referring to drinking water, I'm also referring to alcoholic beverages. People tend to take an alcoholic beverage before going to bed and obviously they're peeing all night. Drinking too much liquid in general before going to bed results in having to go to the bathroom and many times during the night more than you really need to. Now, if you're not drinking too much water at night, then this is something that should give you a heads up. There's something wrong. Something might not be working. Now, the same thing might happen with medications. Two of the most common medications that you might be seeing that cause a problem during your, with urination are diuretic medications, maybe heart problems, cholesterol, or even high blood pressure, and medications that combat sometimes even depression. What you can do is check with your doctor and see if any of the medications you are taking are not affecting the frequency of going to the bathroom. And I'm Patricia Nava, give this up, up and share it with your friends and family. If you have any questions, leave your comments down below and I'll be happy to assist you. If you need quality formulas for your disease or an online appointment, visit drlandmar.com and check out these other videos with this topic of information that might prevent a serious health condition in the future. Thanks for watching you guys and I'll see you soon.